In this video, we'll talk about three cool features we are releasing with our version 21.2. So what you see in my hand is a Fold Z device. It has some apps and folders laid out. At the bottom, you see the taskbar. Uh, this is set up as Windows 11. Uh, on the first page, I have created some widgets. Uh, there's a app called all news which gives you an option to create a news widget just like this okay so i have now three desktops one uh, or rather one two and three if i click two times on the home button it takes me to the very first page of the desktop in this version we have created a new option let me take you there if you notice there's an option called default desktop Let's increase it to two. So now uh, let's see what happens. I'm on the third desktop right now. I go here, I click two times on the home button. And please note that it's not taking you to the first page of the desktop. It's taking you to the second page of the desktop. You can also configure it to take you to the third page. And at this point, that's the max it can take you. Now, if I double tap on the home button, it'll take me to the third desktop. Now, let's talk about the second feature. This is a long awaited feature of configuring the Windows start button. Let's check how it looks. Let's go to the personalized view. Under the theme settings, if you scroll down here, there's a new option which says WinX start button icon. Now let's change this icon. Uh, I can choose any icon from here I want. I'll, I'll choose this one. And as you can see, now we have a new start button icon. If I want to reset it back, I can click on it and now it is back to the default one. Last but not the least, for the Fold C devices, we have added some options to launch the apps in split windows mode. For that, on the personalized settings page of foldable devices, you will see some new settings here. In the default case, when these settings are off, if I open an app, it'll open on the full screen. But if I turn this feature on, let me click on an app. So if you notice now this app is aware of the split screen and it is opening in two different panes. Similarly, let's open the Chrome. Once the second setting is on, every click of an app will create a new instance for you. For example, if I click Chrome, this is the first instance. Now I'm going back, I'm clicking it again. Now there are two instances are open. I go again, click it again. So at this point, if you notice, there are three different instances of the apps open. I'm going to close it all. Please be aware that if you are using this setting, it's going to create multiple instances of the apps. So please use the feature carefully. Um, that is all for today. Thank you very much.